Hello everybody, this is Derek. It is the 30th of September 2009. I hope everybody is doing magnificent. And in this video, I'm going to talk briefly about derivatives. I was asked uh, a few times to talk about it, so I will here. In the more info, there is the Wikipedia page for the derivatives, along with a spectacular video which explains it magnificently, both the short version and a long version. So you have uh, derivatives which are sort of like buying and selling contracts, which is nothing more than a casino style game. Just like I've been saying along with the stock market, you could have stuff like the options, which is another way of trading stocks. It gives you a time frame, maybe a month from now, a year from now, whether you want it to go higher, a stock that is, whether you want it to go lower. And then you got stuff like futures contracts. And future contracts work with commodities, gold, oil, silver, a wheat, corn, almost every single commodity is ex exchanged on there. And you got a bunch of people every single day just placing orders for both buying and selling and it sounds like a big problem that's going to derive from the futures market is that there's not enough gold and silver in the vaults and there is a decent chance that there's going to be like bank runs people wanting to get cash or their gold and their silver that's going to cause a lot of problems and the next one is credit default swaps and that is hang on a second yeah how's it going Mike, 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 right on. Ooh, that's very interesting that you're saying that because I'm just doing a YouTube video right now which is very similar to this actually. Now, how bad is your neighbor's wiring? Does it actually look like it's going to have a fire soon? Okay, well this is what you do. Don't call the fire department. Call up the broker and get yourself a derivative for his house to burn on fire. This way, you can make a killing big time killing. Okay, right on. Okay. Basically, you can bet on tragedy, which has already happened. It happened with Goldman Sachs. When you heard about all of these AIG uh, bailouts and the money that was given to them, it was because they bet with the derivatives credit default swap market that companies, that people would just not be able to pay the loan. Which is a simple bet because when you look at the, the how money is created, how interest is created, and how it's guaranteed to be debt, it's a lock to win. It's almost like taking the uh, Pittsburgh Steelers and putting them up against a high school team and betting that the Steelers are going to beat them. It's that simple of a bet. Sort of like that would have been. And that was not a real phone call, but I presume you knew that anyway. That a fire was going to go down. And you can profit on it. That is what credit default swaps are pretty much all about. Pretty sad, isn't it? I'd have to say it's pretty sad. Thank you everyone for, thank you everyone for watching. Have yourself a great day. Bye-bye.